How to convert 8 digit number to dates in Microsoft Excel. Hello everyone, welcome to Excel 10 tutorial. In this intermediate Excel tutorial, I'm going to show you an excellent trick that will help you cleaning your data set. Here we have dates in column B, but it is not formatted as date. It has total 8 digit number. First 4 digit we have year, then we have 2 digit for date, and last 2 digit is for month, but this is not formatted as dates. So we cannot move on to the next level with this data. So we need to convert it in a way that it will be formatted as date. So we are going to convert this eight digit number to a date in Excel. Let's get started. Now first we need to learn how to extract the year. So for that I'm going to write equal to and then write equal to left. So if I double click here, this is the cell and if I add a comma and add four, it will extract the first four character for me. Okay, that is our year. Then we need to extract month, which is at the right of our number. So for that, I'm going to write equal to then write and select the cell where we have our eight digit. And then if I add comma and we need the only two character from the right. So we have added two and we have our month. And now we need our date, which is at the middle of our number. So I'm going to write equal to and then mid. And as this is the cell where we have our eight digit number that we want to convert to as date. And the first parameter is start number. As we know, the first four character is for year. So we are sure our date will start at the fifth character. So we have starting number as five. And then we want only two character, which is our date. And if I add comma, so this is our date. Now, if I enclosed it inside date function, it will work. So for that, we're going to write equal to and then write. And we have the function date. And you can see date will require year, month and day. And then it will automatically convert everything for us. So again, we can select this at comma for month. We can select this at comma and for day, we can select this. And if I close parenthesis, we have our date. Okay. We can do it or we can write everything inside our single formula. So if I copy it and remove the cell reference of H2 and add the formula for our year, we can copy the formula for our month and we paste it inside the cell reference where we have our month. And the last part is our day. We can copy it from here and we paste it here for our day cell reference. So what we have done there, we have written three formula and we have enclosed it inside the date function, okay? I had referenced this cell inside the date function, but I want it to be in a single formula. That's why I copied everything and placed instead of the cell reference. So it will still work. We have the same date and it is formatted as date. So if I remove this, it doesn't matter. Now, if I drag it and here we have the date, but I don't want the cell per column. I want to remove this and paste it there. So if I right click here and copy, select the range where we have our number, then right click. And then if I select paste as value and here format as date, we have our date here and it will not work. Okay. And I'm going to remove this. So this is how you can convert eight digit number to an actual date in Microsoft Excel. This is what I wanted to show you. Thank you. Thanks for watching. See you in the next tutorial. If you can support the channel through Patreon and don't forget to subscribe. Thank you. Thanks for watching.